Did you know that the Clove Hitch Killer is based off of even scarier real-life events? The movie follows a seemingly normal American man, a man with a wife and two kids, who is on the church council, and of course is also a Boy Scout troop leader. But in real life, that's the story of Dennis Rader, a man who disguised himself as a devoted husband, father, and overall citizen. Now, Dennis was born in 1945 in Pittsburgh, Kansas, but he would grow up in Wichita, Kansas. Now, Dennis was the oldest of his four siblings, all boys, and aside from his parents being gone for work a lot, he had relatively normal parents. But Dennis had darker fascinations from a young age. These are crime scene photos from one of his 1997 victims. But as a preteen and as a teenager, he would cut out pictures of women from magazines and then draw bondage on them. He would then take these pictures that he made and put them on playing cards. He would then carry around these cards everywhere he went. Now, when Dennis turned 18 years old, he did try to go to college, but it didn't exactly work out for him at that time. So instead, in the late 1960s, he started working for the United States Air 